Angela Rozier talked with troopers today as they got ready. And Angela, I understand they've already issued some tickets. Yep, they've been very busy. They were in Broward County earlier this morning, and I'm told they issued uh, dozens of speeding citations. And again, they say if you are drinking and you're caught, you're going to jail. Next to the HOV is lane two, lane three, lane four. Lane four. These are just some of the law enforcement officers who are patrolling South Florida and the Treasure Coast roadways and waterways right now. The goal, zero deaths due to driving under the influence and boating under the influence related crashes this New Year's holiday weekend. To be clear, state troopers do not give breaks to impaired drivers. If we stop you and you are impaired by alcohol and or drugs or both, you will be subject to arrest. State troopers do not call Uber, Lyft, a cab or a friend, but we will take you to jail. Troopers will be conducting speed enforcement from I-95 from the air. When I'm in the air, I'm typically between 2,000, 2,500 feet up. I'm looking for the more aggressive drivers, vehicles that are in and out of traffic, failing to maintain a single lane, and of course, it's speeding. I have speed measuring lines that are identified and I time them with a stopwatch. The chairwoman of Mothers Against Drunk Driving National Board of Directors attended Friday's news conference. Her father was killed by a drunk driver. I keep coming back because I don't want anybody else to experience the loss that I experienced losing my father to a drunk driver nearly 13 years ago. It's a 100% preventable crime and we all have the power to make the decision to not do it, to not drink and drive. Troopers began patrolling earlier in the day in Broward County and issued more than 60 speeding citations. I did a detail this morning and the average speed up there was 137 miles an hour. Yeah, you heard right, 137 miles per hour. Again, they say they will be out here, the aircraft, they'll be patrolling over the holiday weekend. And again, they want to remind everyone to slow down and don't drink or boat and drive. Reporting live in Palm Beach Gardens, Angela Rozier, WPBF 25 News. Uh